This is the Army today. An early spring and mild winter could bring an unwelcome guest sooner than expected. Tick season normally lasts from May to August, but with warmer temps, the eggs could hatch early in some areas. Lyme disease is the most commonly reported vector-borne illness in the U.S. For prevention tips, check out cdc.gov. Soldiers in Italy spend more time jumping thanks to a new facility. Airman First Class Roman Weber reports. Jumping from an aircraft takes confidence, proper training, and trust in your parachute. It also takes trust in the people that pack your parachute. Thanks to a newly designed parachute packing facility at Aviano, the process is a little easier. Once the jumpers use their chutes, the riggers have to bring them right back into the packing facility and get them ready for the next jumper. The first step in their preparation? Shakedown. They're shaking out the parachutes that they jumped last week, making sure that there's no damage to the parachute and that there's no trash and debris inside the parachute. What was once done in two locations can all be done here at Aviano Air Base. But now that the new facility is in the picture, the process is quicker and more cost effective. The parachutes are close to the airfield. It saves the Army a lot of money since, again, they are here. They don't have to do the transportation cost or the personnel moves, the security teams to get them here. This packing facility at Aviano has cut down costs for the military and streamlined the process for the riggers. Five minute walk away, so I mean, it saves a lot of time. Time which they can spend doing what they love, jumping. Airman First Class Roman Weber, Aviano Air Base, Italy. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television.